Hi, I'm attorney Nick Alcock. We're going to talk about disorderly conduct, and quite frankly, disorderly conduct is one of my least favorite statutes in Arizona because you could be convicted of disorderly conduct for knowingly disturbing the peace and quiet of a neighborhood. And I don't know exactly how you define that, but it is the type of statute where if a police officer feels that somebody's being unreasonable in any way, shape, or form, they're making a little bit too much noise, they're being a little bit out of line, they can be charged with disorderly conduct. It's one of those catch-all statutes that police officers love just to charge people with. If a gun is involved, then it becomes a felony. So if you're waving a gun around or if you're, you're um, recklessly handling a gun, shooting a gun, and there's no victim where you're pointing the gun out, but you're just being disorderly with a weapon, then it's a class six felony. But again, that the misdemeanor is such a catch-all phrase that uh, knowingly disturbing the peace and quiet of a neighborhood or person or family. Uh, it's one of those uh, offenses that you don't really know exactly how it's going to be defined until you take it to trial, until you get in front of a judge or you get in front of a jury and they see, well, is this behavior reasonable and, and is it really and, you know, knowingly disturbing the peace and quiet of a neighborhood. If you have any questions about disorderly conduct, I'd love to sit down with you and talk to you about it. Our number is 602-989-5000, 602 -989